33 acres of solar panels in eastern Uganda have started transforming sunshine into much needed power. This $19 million solar power plant has been developed by investors based in Dubai and France with funding from Europe. It's the biggest in the region. So the power output of this plant is 10 megawatts. This is uh, enough power to power up to 40,000 families, uh, schools, small businesses and, and, uh, and users. Neighboring Soroti town has power lines on streets, but blackouts happen almost every week. Shopkeepers face the biggest losses, forced to throw away food due to the unpredictable cuts. Unfortunately, when power is not there for like six hours, that is automatically a loss we're expecting. Because perishable goods cannot stay out of the fridge for a long time, like the minced meat, sausages, ice cream, when they melt, that is a loss automatically. Kenneth Evans Akin runs a DVD shop in town. He relies on batteries during the blackout. But he's optimistic about the new plant. Power supply in the country nationwide is not sufficient. So if this new solar plant has come in to, I would say, back up or top up on the power, then I think it's going to be of too much help. It's going to help, help cover up the gaps of power blackouts that have been there. As night sets in Soroti, most of the streets remain dark. Only 20% of Ugandans have the power from the grid. Uganda's national plan aims to connect the remaining 80% in the next 10 to 15 years.